Hello everybody. Today I have my Kraus Heinz L250 outside. Now, it's just on a regular NEMA head arm. Nothing too special. But the one thing that is different is since that it's outside and lighting our yard, it cannot be 400 watt mercury vapor because that would be way too bright and really annoy the neighbors. So, I'm going to open it up and show you what I put inside. So now that it is open, you can see I have a 65 watt fluorescent bulb inside and an electronic ballast for it. Now the ballast and the bulb came out of a Cooper lighting area light. Now you can see the inside. So this is what it looks like when it's just hanging. There we go. I just turned it on and there is a photo cell. But that photo cell is day burning, plus the little screen on it is pulled over the photo cell, so it's on all the time. There's the bulb, it's pretty nice, works well. The ballast again, and we'll close this thing back up. So there we go, I closed it back up. Looks really nice with a daylight bulb in there. The bulb is 6500K. Really nice fixture. Of course, this is the Westinghouse ballast that came out of the fixture itself. And a GE capacitor. Hope you enjoyed this short little look at my Krauss Heinz L250 with a 65 watt fluorescent bulb in it. Also, please comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.